Welcome back to Vlog Life, Marley. Yeah. And with that being said, hey girl, hey, what's up, dude? What is up? It is your favorite content creator, <laughs> Marley December in the his house today, January 4th, 2021. No, this is not an illusion. This is not a joke. This is not a hokey doke. This is not hoodoo voodoo. This is not me twisting your leg or your arm. I'm really here. I'm really here sharing some beauty and some love with you. Some warmth, some hugs, some new year cheer, honey, because I am very cheerful right now. Sitting outside on my deck, I've lost most of the natural lighting. I think I have about 5% of the natural light left outside for the day because, like I said, I thought I was recording and I was not. <sighs> But anywho, I have my um, artificial light behind me. So prayerfully that will illuminate my beautiful face enough for y'all to see it. And I have my microphone here, my little dead cat to be able to pick up my voice. And I can go ahead and share with you all what it is that I have to share with you as you saw from the title. They are goodies from my birthday that you all have given to me. I absolutely love it. Y'all are the reason why I'm here and my back um kind of sorta i'm just here to share with you what i got for my birthday but i haven't received my permission from god yet to start my vlogging again um 2021 well shall i say the latter part of 2020 as y'all know it's been about seven months uh since i've vlogged edited and uploaded anything um, I will share with you all why that has been, but it's just not right now. God has not given me the okay to do that. So I'm just going to wait and continue to wait. Now, for those of you that want to see this lovely face and hear this gorgeous voice of mine, you can follow me on Instagram, which is down below in my description box, because your girl is over there like almost every day except for Sunday. Sunday, I take off. That is my day to fast from the IG world. Some Sundays I'll fast and some Sundays I don't. I may fast on a Saturday instead. It just depends on how you feel. Or if I don't fast on Sunday, I'll fast on Monday. But that's just it. That's just it. You can follow me on IG or you can follow me on my review channel, which is also linked down in my description box. Some of you have already come over to my review channel and followed me there. And I am ever grateful. I even have some followers that I don't even know. So that lets me know that it's organic. And the views over there are pretty good. I would say I probably have about 20, 30 views for each video within the first two weeks. And then after that, they grow to like 45 or 50. And for 165 followers, I think that's pretty good. Um, because once I went back to that channel, I only had 92 followers and I've grown to 165. So that is just, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. I appreciate it. And I appreciate you as well. Now, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get started with this video. We're going to first start with the clips of those of you that left me a birthday message under my little picture that I have here.
And now I want to go ahead and share my gifts that I received from my family as well as from some of you. Uh, my family totally, totally surprised me. I left that day to go and run some errands and pick up some of my birthday gifts from some of the different companies in the area that give me birthday gifts every year. Oh, I actually left the birthday gifts upstairs. I'm going to have to film that separately because I did leave one upstairs. Um, and that gift is from Ikea. They sent me a... Um, they actually gave me a flower, a, a, shall I say, a house plant for free. So I was very, very grateful of that. I was like, oh my gosh, this is my birthday present. Thank you. I really do appreciate it. So that was that gift from Ikea. And then I have quite a few other gifts from some other companies. Some of them I've picked up, like, you know, you get your free drinks from Starbucks every year. And then I have other companies that give me, uh, oh, I did receive another gift from um belk and i gotta show y'all that too so i forgot to bring all of that down with me but i'll show y'all what that gift is um and i'll just do a little b-roll for that all right love this is the item that i received from belk it is a kim rogers perfectly soft uh shirt and the size small and I absolutely love this shirt. Of course, it's in my favorite color blue. I also like that it has the small slits right here on the side and it fits me perfectly. Some people have complained about the size of the shirt and the length of the shirt, but it fits me perfectly. This is one of the items. I'm going to show you item number two. And the second item that I received from Belk is also from the Kim Rogers line. It is a maxi dress in the size small and um i love that it's sleeveless i absolutely love this material it's like um rayon or acrylic with spandex i love the uh, details of the buttons that they are gold so i will pair this with my gold jewelry <laughs> when i do wear it i love that it has this little belt at the waist and I love that the buttons stop right about at the knee and then the rest of it is this little slit all the way down. And then you have um, the little split here on the right side and then your split here on the left side. So that is too cute. Um, this came in multiple colors, but I chose to go with the salmon color um, because I, I feel that it fit my skin. Uh, my skin tone better and I also didn't want to go for the classic black because your girl will fall for that classic black as she usually does. So these are my two items from Belk for my birthday and I am greatly appreciated. Well, my sister T4, she sent me some money. I was very, very surprised about that. I was not expecting anything. So yeah, I'm ever grateful when my sisters take out the time to think about their big sis and send her something for her birthday, even if it's just a text message. That lets me know that you took time out of your day and you thought about me and you sent me something for my special day. And, um, and I guess it's why I was surprised that my sister did what she did because I was not expecting her to send me any money. Just to send me a happy birthday, sis, I love you and may this be the best year ever would have been great um and then of course i received birthday messages on my facebook page which i never ever go on but i received notifications via my email so i went and thanked those individuals over there and then i received happy birthday wishes on instagram also now for my physical gifts that i have right here next to me i will start with those the first gift that i have here is from my niece and it is it is a LED moonlight. I have always, always wanted an LED moonlight. So when I got this one, I was like, oh my gosh, how did you know? And she was like, I just saw your room the last time that I was here because she was here for Thanksgiving. And she said, I saw the way you have your room decorated because I redecorated my room. And she was like, when I saw this gift, I knew that it would be the perfect gift for you. So she went ahead and got that. And I absolutely love it. So I went ahead and put it together. And um, this is what it looks like, of course. And then it has this cute little stand here. And I love that there are two different 
um, shades of color. So you have here the blue, which kind of looks like a periwinkle to me. And you can switch it over to the white so that you can get that natural um, moon color in the night. And it lights up my room so good. So I told her, I said, this will definitely be great for my room for the time being. But because my goal is to become a nomad at some point in my life, this will be great in my, um, in my RV or my van or truck or whatever. Well, the, yeah, or my truck, just meaning an SUV. So one of the three, RV, van, or truck is what I'm going to do my nomadic lifestyle in. And I actually have some some footage coming up for you all that's kind of similar to that. Um, and, uh, you know, that's when God gives me the permission to share with you all, I will. <laughs> so that was a gift from my niece, and I absolutely love it. Um, and then here's this gift is from my daughter and I'm missing a gift where did I put it y'all I'm missing some gifts but this is from my daughter and it is this large sweatshirt from um, Target and it me it reads stay true and it has all of the different faces of Mickey Mouse on it and I absolutely love it. It is so soft and it is so comfortable. So I'm really, really, really loving this. I was like, oh my gosh, thank you. And then the next gift that I received from my daughter is this um, t-shirt that reads Bonita and Bonita is uh, pretty in Spanish. So I thought this is really, really cute. And this is also so, so comfortable. So I would definitely be wearing that um, over the summer months. And for my birthday cards, my cousin, actually, hold on a second. Okay, so as I was saying, my cousin um, was one of the family members that drove by on my birthday and she dropped some gifts and balloons outside for me. So because she knows that I love Mickey Mouse, she picked up this dream Mickey Mouse ornament um, to put on the Christmas tree. And she picked up this solar bobblehead Mickey Mouse. And then she and my daughter picked up the same exact Christmas, I mean birthday card. <laughs> And I was like, oh my gosh, you can tell we're family. So it reads, a special birthday wish. Let me grab my glasses for you so I can read what it says. And it reads, in the midst of your busy life, if your birthday gives you a moment to reflect on what you mean to so many, may you feel happy knowing that you're thought of warmly, cared about deeply, and wished every happiness and then this one is from my daughter and it reads happy birthday mom love Asia and then of course this one is from my cousin and, and she says my sentiments exactly I love you cuz enjoy your day with love and then she has her name so I was like oh my gosh that is so amazing that they have the same they picked out the same birthday card so then Asia also picked out this card and it reads the top five things you're still too young for now i laughed at this one because i thought that it was so funny because some of the things that are on here i actually have used when i was in my 20s um this is actually a card that you're supposed to get for like your sister or your best friend because it says the top five things we're still too young for but they should cross out the we part and put you so number five plastic rain scarves y'all I cracked up when I saw this because when I was in my 20s, like straight out of high school, I used to wear those plastic rain scarves because your girl was not trying to get her hair wet in the rain. So that was the best way for me to protect my hair. So I wore those plastic rain scarves. I was just like, oh girl, what? Of course my friends used to laugh at me, but I did not care because look, my hair was still straight. Theirs was puffy. <laughs> so yeah, love myself a plastic rain scarf. Then number four, seven day peel organizer. Yeah, I'm too young for the seven day peel organizer. And then number three, once a week hairdos. And then number two, tissue in every pocket. No, I don't have tissue in every pocket. I didn't even have tissue in every pocket when Asia was a baby. So I'm definitely too young for that. 
And the number one thing you're still too young for, granny panties. <laughs> Happy birthday, love, Asia. And then she wrote, even though you already do two out of five, you're still too young, but you don't look a day over 40. And I was like, oh, thanks, baby girl. Ooh, thank you. So I absolutely loved her birthday cards and her birthday gifts. So that is that. And then, hey loves, it's your girl. I needed to stop the video of which would not be up at noon. I thought it was going to be up at noon, but you know, we had a lot of stuff we needed to do this morning. Um, needed to go and vote and all of that stuff like that. And I had some stuff to do for work and whatnot. So yeah, life is life. It is what it is as long as the video gets up today. But as I was doing my editing for the video, I was look, I looked across the room and I saw this gift over here of which I forgot to share with you. And I said, oh my gosh, I cannot not include that gift in the video. What in the world? No, Marley, pause what you're doing. Get this in the video so they can see it. It is one of the cutest gifts I have ever received from anyone. It is hilarious. I cracked up. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so glad that you purchased this because my daughter almost didn't purchase it. She was like, mom, I was so indecisive. I didn't know if I wanted to get it. I didn't know if you would like it. I went and got it. I um, put it back, went and got it again, put it back. People in the store were looking at me like, girl, what is wrong with you? Because she was laughing about it every time she went over and saw it. So she went ahead and got it. And that was one of the first gifts that she made me open. Now, a little backstory as to how this gift occurred um, or the choice for this gift occurred. About two weeks before my birthday, I was walking up the stairs and my right knee, of which I injured when I was in my 20s, gave out. I was playing flag football when I was in my 20s, so that's why the knee injury occurred. Yes, yes, and yes, your girl played flag football. Um, she also played kickball. Mm -mm -mm, and was really good at it but I couldn't run the way that I used to run anymore so I had to give up both sports so it was what it was you know that's why I say do what you can why you can when you can girl because as you get older you will not go be able to do the things you used to do live life honey live life um so I was coming up the stairs about two weeks before my birthday. My knee gave out. My daughter heard me saying, oh my gosh, my knee. Man, I need to do something about my knee. And then when she saw this gift, she was like, this is the perfect gift. I have to give this gift to my mom. So without further ado, because we don't want this video to be any longer than it already is, the gift of which I am referring to is the old lady cane. I absolutely love this thing. It has all of these cute little trinkets and gadgets on it and I'm gonna quickly share them with you. So here at the top, we have the little area where you can put your eyeglasses. So if they're on your head or around your neck, you're not wandering around the house or even on your face because sometimes we'll have our glasses right here on our face. Oh, I can't even put that on there. <laughs> Why did I even try that? But we will have our glasses on our face, on our heads or around our neck and be walking around like, girl, what are my glasses? Where are my glasses? And they're like, it's on your face. They're on your head. They're around your neck. So that's what this is for. So you should always be able to see where your glasses are. The second thing that we have on here, the little trinket, is a little horn to let people know you are on the way, honey. Girl, the queen is on the way. And then this little trinket here is the Happy Peel capsule. And the Happy Peels, one, helps to keep you slim. So I was like, oh, yes, girl. Definitely want to stay slim because, uh... <laughs> These knees are not carrying all of this weight. That's why they're hurting right now. Because anytime I'm over 150 pounds, that's when my knees started hurt, starts hurting. And then it also helps to prevent hot flashes. But I haven't really had hot flashes since 2019, which is when I removed my birth control. So I was like, mmm, the hormones, the hormones. And the next thing, oh, the last portion of the happy pill, it attracts, or shall I say the last quality of the happy pill they attract younger men so i was like um <laughs> i don't know if i want the pool boy uh because um these little boys girl i was like uh no baby they all up in my dms on instagram talking about some hey ma hey beautiful i'm not your mama okay stop calling me mom because i'm not your mama um, I'm not your shorty. I, I, I don't want to be your boo thing. I, no. No. Mm -mm. 
Stop it. Like, for real. Mm-mm. <laughs> For real. So that part of the the, the happy pill, I, I, I don't think I really want. Um, Because you got to be at least 40 or older. Like, for real. You got to be older than my youngest sister. She's 38. So, yeah. And even then, I still probably don't want to deal with you. How about that? All right. Next, we have the hot flash fan, of course, which I said I don't need the hot flash fan because I haven't had hot flashes since I got rid of my birth control in 2019. And then, of course, here we have the warning sign to let you know that the old lady is approaching, honey. And if you are not paying attention to the fact that the queen is on her way, what you doing? Because if this, if this don't help you and this don't help you to know she's coming, this definitely will. Too cute. I said it's like when the little kid had the little squeaky shoes or the little bells on their shoes to let you know that they was on the move. This is too adorable. <laughs> it's too adorable. Now, I'm not sure how much she paid for this. Um, like I said, she definitely got it from Party City. So if you are interested in buying it for a friend, one of your family members, your spouse, whatever, Party City is where it's at. You can probably order it, order it on Amazon or some other um, site. But my daughter bought this one from Party City. And I thought that it is absolutely adorable. And I will forever keep this. It reminds me of the gratitude of, of life. The gratitude of age. So without further ado, because I know some attention spans are just like that. And you probably already clicked off. We're going to go ahead and get into the video for those of you that are still here. And um, I pray that you enjoy what you see and be sure to leave the emoji that I asked you to leave if you watch it all the way through. All right, let's get started. I received this box in the mail. Hold on, I'm coming. Uh, whew, I received this box in the mail yesterday. And I was like, she was like, mom, you have a box outside. And I said, I do? And she was like, yeah. So she brought it upstairs to me and I got it. I was like, oh my gosh, what is this? I didn't order anything from, oh, it's from my birthday wish list. Um, but I went ahead and opened the box. I haven't really looked in it, but I did see one of the gifts and I was like, oh, it's what I really wanted. So I would definitely share that with you. Also, if you would like to, you don't have to, you are not even obligated to, but if you would like to, purchase something for me for my birthday my target wish list is down in the description box as well i always keep it down there um, for each year that i celebrate my birthday because people are always what do you want for your birthday what do you want for your birthday i honestly didn't want anything for my birthday or for christmas but everybody kept asking what do you want what do you want you need to create this you know i created my birthday wish list like the day before my birthday yeah so this came in, it is really heavy, and I'm excited to see what it's, um, what's in here. It is from Bradley, thank you, I absolutely love you. And if you don't know Bradley, um, be sure to go and check him out. He is a teacher, he lives in South Carolina. We have been YouTube buddies since day one. And um, I love the support that he gives to me and my family, and he, um, loves the support that I give to him and his family and I also want to take this time out to ask you all to say a prayer for his dad because his dad was diagnosed with COVID and he um, is having issues with his respiratory right now so we just I just want to send that out and ask you guys to say a prayer for um, for his dad so let's go ahead and um, open this up and see what TPG got me Okay, so I see the one, I'm super duper excited, the one that I saw, I can't really see what's on the other side because of the bubble that's there, the bubble paper that's there, but I do see this one, and oh wow, this is what's making the box heavy, and it is the Himalayan glow lamp that I have always, always wanted. And oh my gosh, I'm gonna connect this. I'm gonna set this up probably tomorrow and um, go ahead and get everything 
situated with my room, but I'm super duper. <laughs> I'm super duper excited about this. So thank you so much, Brad. I really, really do appreciate this. And you could have just bought me this and I would have been happy. You know that, right? I would have been really happy with just this, but you have more things in here for me. So I'm going to look to see what you have. And I know, like I told you, whatever you buy me, I'll, you could have bought me a bag of white chocolate M&M's peanut and I would have loved it. All right. And oh my gosh, oh my gosh, you got me the Mickey Mouse t-shirt. Oh, thank you. If y'all don't know by now, I am a huge Mickey Mouse fan. But look at this. Oh my gosh. Now this shirt. This is so cute. Look at Mickey Mouse with the tongue out. <laughs> and this is the same t-shirt as the Bonita. But this one is in Mickey Mouse instead of Bonita. So I now have two um, t-shirts in that design. Thank you so much, TPG. Okay, what's this? two of these in here wrapped up like this oh wow let's see what's this oh it's my candle <laughs> okay this is another thing i absolutely love and when i say love i love candles and this one is Good. This one is soft cashmere and lavender. Mmm. Let me show y'all what it looks like. Um, and this also was on my wish list. I think I have a lot of candles on my wish list. And this is by Threshold, which is one of Target's um, main brands that they carry in the store. So absolutely loving that. And I love this jar because I can repurpose it once i use all of the wax all right so let's see what this one is i'm sure because it's wrapped the same way it's another candle but i want to see which fragrance he picked out for me um this one is charcoal and black tea that's my favorite oh it smells so good oh this smells so good this smells delicious oh my gosh this smells delicious but that's what that one is and it is also made by threshold i think i'm telling y'all that right yeah it is it's made by threshold so you can see there so i'll put that here and let me double check the box to make sure that was everything yeah, the only thing that's left in here is a card. I hope you enjoy your gifts. Love, Bradley. Yes, I do. I hope you enjoy your gifts. Happy belated birthday and Christmas. Oh, so this is Christmas and my birthday. Thank you, boo. Um, I really do appreciate it. I absolutely love it. You guys have definitely brought a smile to your girl's face. And um, I am ever appreciative. I mean, ever appreciative of every single thing that you all have ever done for me because you really didn't have to do it. You could have done anything else, but you decided to take some time out of your day and make sure that I felt loved, um, make sure that I was happy and that um, you, you're just showing me that you appreciate what it is that I give to you as a friend. And no, I'm not always speaking to everybody every day because you know that my life is very busy. It's even more so busy now that I'm stacking these bags. But um, I appreciate that you all love me for who I am and not for what it is that I can give you. Um, and that's that. I'm going to end it here. Thank you all for tuning in. I don't, I, I'm sure this video is probably longer than I intended it to be. <laughs> um, but um, thank you for those that stayed to the end leave your girl a heart and a birthday cake if you can 
um, for those that made it all the way to the end. I love each and every one of you. And as I always say, because this is what, 2021, we got 365 more days. And, well, actually 361 because we're in day four right now. So you got 361 new days to make 361 new choices, okay? And you have 361 new chances to make those 361 new choices make those choices good i love you and as i always say your life is the vision you create bye